Rapport International, Professional Translation and Interpretation Services. Last week, I got together with a friend of mine, uh, Jay Doback, who is the owner of Last Minute Productions, where they do videos. He's a pretty well-known company here around Massachusetts, been around forever, and they do a great job. And it got me to thinking about your websites and what do you do with your videos that you have on your website when you have translated your website. You don't want to pop them up there in English only because you're missing the clientele. It doesn't look localized and customized to that language. Um, and so you've got to do something with them. You've spent the time and money to create these great videos and now you really want them to reach their audience. Well, you basically have two options. One is that you do a voiceover. Uh, and that would be uh, translating the script and then hiring the voice talent and then you could dub it over. Um, and the second would be that you could do the subtitles underneath. And both are good options. You can hand, uh, you know, you could do either one of them. Doing the subtitles is going to be less expensive. If you already have your script, you're not going to have to pay to transcribe it. You take your script, you get it translated, and then you just, um, you know, it's just a simple edit to put the titles on there. If you want to do a voiceover, you have to uh, translate the script, then give it, get it and get the person in. So the, top, the subtitles work really well if you're targeting an international audience and they're used to reading subtitles. A lot of movies come out from Hollywood and so a lot of the big uh, name movies that go out around the world are uh, subtitles and so a lot of people are using them. They're uh, internationally people aren't as opposed to it as we are here in the United States. It's also if it's a simple video and you want to have that done then you can have the translation on it. If you're targeting a millennial crowd who is used to multitasking, sometimes it's better to have the dub uh, voices over it um, because then as they're playing their videos and doing their chats and doing everything else, they're um, actually listening to what the content is. So if it's a highly visual video, um, subtitles might work because the person's eye is already on there, but if it's something that you're educating and learning and you're targeting the millennial audience, it might be better to actually do the vo uh, voiceover. So it does depend. Um, then the other question we get about it is how much does it cost? If you're looking at a video of a couple minutes um, to do the translation, you're looking at $100 to $200. It's cheap money. It's a little bit more for the video editing we do in-house, or you can uh, hire somebody like Last Minute Productions to do it or work with your videographer. If you have any questions, click the link be below and uh, schedule a um, evaluation or assessment with us, and we can give you exact prices, exact time, and what we'd recommend for doing it. Thanks so much. We'll talk to you later.